Hey there guys, I uh, want to make a little video. We finally got the um, RU584-1 mirror state and we're going to show how um, it can be put into the NRF frame. Um, of course, in some of the videos before, we just had a little test sample that I was um, using, testing some vehicle options. But now that there's a little bit more, I want to show you what this actually looks like. And it's quite different in appearance um, from normal RU. It actually has kind of like a little iridescent hue, um, part of the lipid nature. So it's really... Uh, it's quite uh, neat to be able to see, physically, you know, see these differences. Hopefully, can you zoom? So, what we're going to do today is uh, now the NRF cream vehicle was uh, shown to be a suitable vehicle in the actual study, and that's what we have replicated here today. And um, it's probably going to be most applicable on the hairline, and maybe for a few of you, if you know, if, if there's a lot of hair loss around the crown, you might be able to sneak it in there. Um, but nevertheless, we want to go ahead and make it up for the first time to see how it actually makes this. So what we're going to do is make a 5% solution. And um, when you receive the NRF cream, it's going to come in a, a jar about this size. The thing is, similar to normal RU, we aren't totally sure about the stability. So you wouldn't want to make an entire jar with, uh, with the rum. So you want to make up smaller batches. And to do that, we're going to weigh out a certain amount. Um, we're going to weigh out 40 grams of the cream and then um, 2 grams of the rum because that would be two per, or 5%. So let's go ahead and do that now. Let's see if I can turn this on. I've just got an empty jar here. This is just so I can simply weigh out 40 grams of the cream. See how this goes? Let's first a little bit. Now, of course, this is already made up with the preservatives in it as well, which is great. Um, you don't have to be as worried. It is pretty much ready to go. Okay, 52. I'm just trying to get to roughly. Now, of course, um, you're going to make up an appropriate amount, just like when people use normal RU that you see fit. You know, some people even make it up daily. Some people make it up weekly, bi you know, bi-weekly. Um, it, and it's dependent on how much you use. Now just for this demonstration purposes, we wanted to use a, a sufficient amount so you know we could demonstrate it and we thought that 40 grams of this um, that's pretty much close enough. Just a little bit in there. Mixing it, you know, with 2 grams would be a good way to demonstrate that. Yeah, we'll stick with that. Give one second, let me set this down here. <clears throat> now, um, see I'm going to transfer it over. We've got a rough estimate. See if I can put it in here. Now again, you may be able to mix it, of course, in your own little jar, but we wanted to mix it in here just to make sure it's done very thoroughly, and uh, of course we'll be able to see very well in video what this looks like. So now that that is all cleared out, next step is to, uh, like we've done in the past, weigh out the um, RU584-1 mirror stick. To do that, we have our more precise scale here. See if we can go ahead and turn it back on, make sure it is zeroed in. Go ahead and open up the ROM packet. A nice little Ziploc. Makes it easy for you to I'm going to use one of these smaller. And we'll simply dump, dump it into there. Be careful when you open it. Okay, here it goes. I'm going to see. Let's weigh this out. It's almost a gram. Two gram is the mark. We're worth 1.3. Or 4. 1.8. Very close. That's pretty, that's very close. I'm going to go with it. Okay, now I'm going to be careful to seal this back up. Just like storing your normal RU, you probably want it to be airtight. And you know, it's probably a little more stable at room temperature, but I would still like to store it in the fridge just for safekeeping. Now, here we go. I'm going to go ahead and for the first time mix this together. Let's see if I can put this. 
this here. So this over here. <coughs> Add the weight out two grams again. Let's see if we can get this. Here it goes. Alright, and I think we'll retrieve it with a spoon, put it back into the jar, which of course you can put it back into, you know, if you mix it up in the jar, you can keep it in there originally, you know, whatever you're going to store it in. Um, of course, I'm going to transfer it back into one of these larger bleed jars because we had that available. Alrighty guys, I think this has been a video of this. There should be an application video to come later. Uh, we'll actually apply the NRF cream with the rum on the temples or the hairline and see how uh, see how it works thank you